Welcome to this video. Are you interested in why your vehicle diagnosis displays P0092? How is the error code interpreted by the vehicle? What does P0092 mean, or how to correct this fault? Today we will find answers to these questions together. Let's do this. First, let's look at the history of diagnostic fault code composition according to the OBD2 protocol, which is unified for all automakers since 2000. We divide the electric system of automobile into the four basic units. Powertrain. Body. Chasis. Network. This distribution is defined in the first character code. If the second character is expressed as zero, it is a standardized error. In the case of numbers 1, 2, 3 it is a more prestigious expression of the car-specific error. The third character specifies a subset of errors. The distribution shown is valid only for the standardized DTC code. Only the last two characters define the specific fault of the group. Let's not forget that such a division is valid only if the other character code is expressed by the number 0. Our website airbagreset.sk produces useful videos for you. You do not have to go through the OBD2 protocol anymore to know how to troubleshoot any car breakdown. You will find all the diagnostic codes that can be diagnosed in a Jeep, vehicles, also many other useful things. The following demonstration will help you look into the world of software for car control units. You unbelievably can move the video a bit further. The error code is split into two bytes consisting of 16 bits. One bit is the basic unit that each computer works with. The bit has two logical states. 0, low level. 1, high level. By combining the first two bits, the basic character of the error code is expressed. The next two bits again determine the second character. The last bit styles of the first byte define the third character of the code. The second byte is composed of a combination of eight bits. The first four bits determine the fourth character of the code. And the combination of the last four bits defines the fifth character. A single byte conceals 256 possible combinations. We now know in what way the diagnostic tool translates the received information into a more comprehensible format. The number itself does not make sense to us if we cannot assign information about it to what it actually expresses. So, what does the diagnostic trouble code P0092 interpret specifically for Jeep car manufacturers? The basic definition is fuel pressure one control circuit high. And now this is a short description of this DTC code. The fuel quantity solenoid FQS works in tandem with the fuel pressure regulator FPR to control fuel volume and pressure in the fuel rail. The FQS is positioned in the inlet side of the high pressure delivery pump HPDP. The FQS receives 12 volts and a duty cycle ground signal from the powertrain control module PCM. The FQS is normally open, so when the FQS is not actuated no ground signal from the PCM, the HPDP The HPDP inlet passage is open allowing full fuel flow to the pumping chambers inside the HPDP when the PCM grounds the FQS control signal the FQS closes the fuel inlet passage, preventing fuel from entering the pumping chambers the FPR is positioned at the return passage of the fuel rail the solenoid receives 12 volts from the PDC and a duty cycle ground signal from the PCM the FPR is normally open and when the solenoid is not actuated no ground ground signal from the PCM, the fuel rail return passage opens allowing fuel pressure in the rail to escape into the return circuit and onto the fuel tank when the PCM grounds the FPR control signal, the solenoid valve closes allowing fuel pressure to build in the rail the fuel pressure regulator is not serviceable separate of the fuel rail assembly. This diagnostic error occurs most often in these cases. K646 Fuel Pressure Regulator Control Circuit Shorter to VOLTAGEFUEL Pressure REGULATORPOWERTRAIN Control Module PCM The Airbag Reset website aims to provide information in 52 languages. 
Thank you for your attention and stay tuned.